How can we love immigration and hate immigration at the same time? Well, there's a way, there's a way to do it, you know, and we've done it for a very, very long time. Because we've established in our minds that there are two kinds of immigration. Does anybody know what they are? It's not legal and illegal. It's the immigration that's already happened. So the past immigration, we love that. That's why we're so into genealogy. That's why we go to the Lower East Side Tenement Museum. That's why we kick, go out to Ellis Island. We love, and telling stories of grandpa coming from Greece with five cents in his pocket and all, and, would, and I'm not downplaying that. These are just, there's good reason to love those stories. They are the great stories of America in a lot of ways, comma. But we hate immigration that's happening right now. And what's interesting and so important to realize is that when Grandpa the Greek was coming to America with five cents in his pocket, people absolutely hated him and wanted to, would do anything to keep him out of this country and did not believe that he could ever become a good American, that he would ever be productive, that he would ever learn English, that he would ever understand democracy, and that he could ever change his, his biology, right? He was literally racially inferior. So, Pick a moment in history, 1705, 1805, 1905, 2017, Americans say immigration used to be great and now it's terrible. It's always been the way. 